What's going on, stackers? So over the last eight months, nope, nine months, one book has made me over $3,000 in royalties and it sells consistently every single day. Now, if you're new here, my name's Paddy and every single day, I like to bring out videos teaching you how to make money with nothing more than your internet connection and your laptop. So go hit subscribe and hit that little bell icon so you can be notified for any further videos. Also, if you're serious about low and no content book publishing, then check out that link in the description below to go to Printing Profits. This course lays out everything that I did step by step to get to $1,000 per month within three months. You can also get there by going to printingprofits.com with no G. So, $3,000 earned in nine months from one book. Let's take a look at that. As you know, if you watched one of my previous videos, I had a really good month last month. But let's go to all time and let's scroll down. This is the book that has made me or has sold over a thousand units. Oh, if we look at that, I've now broke $15,000 in nine months. That's pretty, pretty amazing. And I'm super happy about that. So let's scroll down to here. Stop right there. So this is the book. So the last video I made about this book, I think it was how I've sold a thousand units of one book. I think that book was made, not the book, I think that video was made last week. So I've made another 176 sales since then <clears throat> of that one book. And as we can see here, it sold or made me in royalties so this is profit, this isn't sales. I know some people get a little bit confused by that, but this is royalties that go straight to my bank. So this is just profit. So that's $3,219 just from one book. And if we look at these, so my two other best performing books, this one was my teacher one, which you probably know a little bit about that which sold really well here in the UK. That's where the majority of those sales came from. And then my third best seller, which has made me over a thousand dollars as well, was, which one's this? This is my Valentine's Day notebook. So this did, this did extremely well back in February. Now from here, we can see that 73% of my sales come from the US and 25% from the UK. What I'm also seeing when people first get into publishing that the most of their sales are coming from the UK and I can't quite put my finger on it and figure out why that is. So if you've recently started publishing, let me know if most of your sales are coming from the UK or the US. See, when I first started as well, quite a lot of my sales came from the UK, but then over the time, most of them just come from the US. Now, from the pie chart, you can see that I do have a few books that have done extremely well, and then the majority are just from books that sell a few times a month. That's how I make the majority, or probably about half of my money. I got those niches, that sell once a month, once every couple of weeks, and so on and so on. So, $3,000 from one book. I'm extremely happy about this. I also know that $3,000 from one book isn't really that much compared to other publishers. But that does not bother me. So why is that? It's because I don't focus on what other people are doing. I focus only on my own business. So I don't worry about how many books someone else has got. 
I don't worry about how much they're making because my business is going to be completely different to everyone else's. And I'd rather put my time and energy into my own business than wasting it worrying that I don't have as many books or making as much money as this person over there. And you should think the same. Now I'm only showing you these results because I like to be transparent and I like to show you how my own business is going so it can inspire you. But don't look at that I have over 2000 books and think, oh no, I need to create so many books to create an income because the reality is you're going to get completely different results. You might even only create 200 books, but end up making more than me because everyone is completely different. So don't focus about other people, focus on your own business, have set your own publishing goals and smash right through them. Now, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Also, go hit subscribe and hit that little bell icon so you can be notified for any further videos. That being said, I've been Paddy, this has been Stacking Profit, and I'll see you again soon.